uh, what to do if pc health checkup uh, app not working and fail to check compatibility to run windows 11 pc health checkup is an important tool to use for checking of compatibility to run windows 11 in your system you can frequently use this tool whenever any new version of windows introduced by microsoft if you want to run windows 11 in your pc you should check compatibility to run windows 11 through pc health checkup app but some of the users reported that this tool failed to check compatibility today in this video we will see how to fix a pc health checkup app not working properly and the first one is there may be a possibility that your current health checkup app is of older version and that leads to failed compatibility checkup. You must download latest version of PC health checkup app for Windows 10. Go to the available link and download the latest PC health checkup app. The second way is apply repair tools. Press win logo plus R or apply a right click on a start menu and click on run command box. Type appwiz.cpl in it and press OK button. This command will open programs and features option under control panel. Find out the PC health checkup app. Apply a right click on it and choose the option repair. Windows will now search and repair unwanted happenings in PC health checkup app. And the third one is apply SFC a scan now feature. Any corrupted file system may be a cause of PC health checkup app not responding or working properly. Simply go to run command box, type cmd, press ctrl shift plus enter to open run command, uh, command prompt window in administrative mode. Now in black window box type sfc slash scan now and press enter. It will scan your system or any corrupted file system. And the fourth one is disable any third party antivirus. If you have installed any third party antivirus in your system, sometimes it may restrict the running process of PC Health Checkup app. You should temporarily disable the antivirus and check the browser opening status to disable antivirus. Simply open the antivirus page, turn the toggle button to off or click on disable button. That's all. Thank you.